What is a regression tree, Tom or Molly? A regression tree uses a series of simple decisions to come up with a prediction. And each decision is simply whether you are above or below the dividing point on each variable. How about some examples, Tom? Well, there could be a sport where the score depends on a person's height and weight. Yes, somebody over six feet might do very well, but a heavy person over 200 pounds, not so well. That's exactly right. We choose the first branch as the one which makes the most difference in the score. For instance, being above six feet in this example is worth five extra points. Then we move to the variable that makes the second most difference. So we have a series of factors whose effects add together. Does this remind you of something? Yes, it's like linear regression where you add several straight lines together. Yes, and each of those straight lines represents one variable's contribution to the results. But they're done by continually adding more, where in the regression tree it's a single step, left or right. Let's work out one example. Suppose the software tells us that People under six feet have an average score of 20, while people over six feet have an average score of 30. And then, for the tall people, being over 200 pounds reduces your score by five points. What would the expected score of a six foot two player who weighs 225 pounds be. Well, being over six feet would give the player 30 points. Yes, and then being over 200 pounds would subtract five for a final score of um, 30 minus five uh, equals 25. Could there be a third or maybe even a fourth factor? Why, sure, Molly. There can be as many factors as are significant, and modern software can find them.